Brian Stone, he's a Canadian. A Canadian, a Canadian. And he was part of the Canadian Navy. No, the Canadian Navy. That's better. And he spells his name with an I and not a Y because his parents hated him. Check out his channel by searching YouTube for Ryan Stone. No, Ryan Stone. That's better. Hello, children. Uh, the old Capmeister here, and we have a Clary test request. If you have a Clary test request, you can patent it. Cannot be done by anybody, only officially approved by me. Who did the Clary test request when I'm dead? I do not know. Uh, hi, Aaron. Return Clary test customer here. Could you do a test on the current and previous governor of the home, my home state of Wisconsin? Uh, and they are Tony Evers and Scott Walker. What is your opinion on some things like Walker did, like stripping collective bargaining rights from the teachers here and giving $3 billion in taxes as a fo uh, Foxconn? I am for him. Anything that hurts the teachers is fine by me. And I will even <clears throat> go so far as I hate teachers so much because they are effectively child abusers in my mind, most of them, or child prison guards. I don't, I don't think they actively abuse the children. Um, I don't care. I'd have to sit and think about what collective bargaining is. Um, I don't care. Uh, vile, evil communists deserve vile, evil things. Fuck them. Uh, but giving, going back to a principle, are giving $3 billion in tax incentives? No. You either lower taxes for everybody and make Wisconsin a business-friendly state for everyone, and you have the really... This is the number one complaint of all Republicans, and it's true. You fuckers don't do equal uh, opportunity. You all say you're for that, and you are more for it than the Democrats, but then it's all hobnobbing and buddy-buddy. I mean, I'm writing the piece now about baby boomer, boomer bosses in my book. I'm like, holy shit, I remember how un it was. You know, you make it equal opportunity for everybody. And, uh, <clears throat> oh, well, we'll give you a special discount, and you a special, but not everybody. So I'm, I'm principally against... We're going to give you $3 billion in tax incentives for Foxconn. I know it's going to bring in a lot of, um, a lot of uh, uh, jobs and business for Milwaukee. They're developing it over on the south, uh, 143. That's, why can't you just make that a principle for everything? This is why no state income taxes is a good idea. Oh, no, we're and then just to dick around, how many meetings, how much time was wasted? Oh, well, we'll give, we'll give you this, we'll give you that. All the time and money pissed away trying to court Amazon's latest fulfillment department and uh, they're looking at Queens. Where did they go? I forgot where. Uh, as for Evers who defeated Walker last year, it's too early to tell, but he seems like a liberal, li a, a wimpy liberal educational bureaucrat. Oh, if he's a Democrat, I'm sure when we do the Clary test on him, he's, he'd never worked a day in his life. Um, I'm sure you know, I know, I'm sure in, I'm sure in no what your opinion will be on that. Anyways, should have ran for office and would have had a beer with either. Uh, name your price and keep up the good work, Pat. All right, so let's pull up. Um, Scott Walker. Scott Walker, 52. Born in Colorado Springs. Why did he move to Wisconsin? I was sitting in Colorado. Um, <clears throat> raised in Iowa and then Delavan, Wisconsin. He was elected to the Wisconsin State Senate in 1992. So, 92 from 69, 92 from 67. He was 25. Okay, career fucking politician right off the bat. I don't, I don't like him. I don't like, I like what he did, but already not doing well in the, uh, in the Clary test. Elected to a full term in 2004, re-elected in 2008. Ran for governor in 2006, but dropped out. Ran again in 2010 and won. National Guard, Jersey, Wisconsin, bada boo, booty bee. Sponsored bill, protested, da da da, prevent the bill, nevertheless. Wisconsin budget repair came to law in 2011. Opposition to balancing the budget and being fiscally responsible was stopped by a bunch of whiny, cry communist Democrats. <clears throat> All right, that's early thing. Um, the elder of two sons, Patricia Pat, a bookkeeper, and Lewin, a Baptist minister. Moved to Plainfield, Iowa, where Lou worked as a pastor, served municipal council when Mark was 10 years old. Then moved to Delavan, Wisconsin, where started to continue work as a minister. All right, he didn't come from wealth. Uh, he's an Eagle Scout. That's good. 
He rolled in Marquette. Became student center, let it come in. Yeah, okay, already, already he just, what was his degree? Oh, uh, what did he study? Scott Walker, college degree. Major, what did he study? Political science. In fact, the government, oh, he never, won he never got a <coughs> college degree. Um, fourth year in good standing to take a job at the American Red Cross. What did he major in? I want to know. That will desperately tell me everything I want to know about him. Um, let's try as Scott Walker studied. I'm getting the musician, Scott Walker. What did Governor Walker study in college? Going to study business. <clears throat> oh, he always thought he was going to study business. He was bored studying political science and wanted to build his career. Fuck you. Fuck you, Scott Walker. Um, okay, so worthless degree. Career politician already. What's he doing now? I wonder what he's doing now. I wonder if he's like trying to get back into politics or maybe he became an accountant. Uh, early life in education. Worked on a campaign. Worked at the Red Cross. I'm not considering that real work. Clary, I did it. Shut up. At the age of 22, he ran for the 7th District. Fuck this guy. He's a career politician. Governor, what's he doing now? I'm kind of curious what he's doing now. Budget repair bill. Doody do, doody do, doody do. He's gonna run for no. Don't run for presidential campaign. No. Oh, that was 2016. Never mind. After <clears throat> we become president of the Young America's Foundation, a conservative student. Fuck you. No. Okay. No real world working experience. Worthless fucking degree. Career politician. Um, he didn't come from wealth. Uh, so he gets that. I go. I'm gonna put. Uh, worthless degree. <clears throat> No private sector experience. What's he doing now? Career politician. Yeah, he gets a he gets a three. Should he have run for office? Fuck no. Do I want to have a beer with him? Fuck no. I don't talk to my inferiors. I don't want to, I don't want to have anything to do with an. It, this is one of the worst cases. This is exactly what it comes up. You don't want someone arrogant and cocky enough like him, a 22 year old, thinking he has the wisdom to go and lead the country. Let alone a a, a congressional district or a state uh, district. All right, <clears throat> let's find the next guy. Tony Evers. Oh, jeez. <laughs> is this like the original Soy Boy? This is, this is like Boomer Soy Boy. This is, this is the first Boomer Soy Boy. Oh, God, look at this. Putz. Oh, God. Look at, oh, I'd love to use words I can't, and it would not mean an insult. Uh, two. Uh, he's got a PhD in what? Early life. Oh, God. I can already tell you four. This guy is not shoveled snow, let alone, uh, okay, 51. To a physician father, has money. Doctoral degrees. He began his professional career as a teacher. Worthless degree. What's his doctorate in? Doctoral degrees in education. All right. So, and then he was a teacher. That's not a real job at the Thomas School from 1979-1980. Principal, school, 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 superintendent, superintendent, Verona, school, school, nonprofit, department of education, uh, super, uh, okay. All right. All right. 
came from wealth, worthless degree, no real work experience. I mean, look at him. Look at this. Oh, God, I want to use the words, but I just can't. It would not be an offense to the homosexual community because it, it, that's not the intention. It's the South Parkian intention. I want this putz. No. He gets a four. He fails it miserably. This is exactly the type of... This is not a man. You have a soy. You have to, Tony Evers, the first soy boy, the boomer soy boy. Oh, my God. No. I don't have to read through this crap. Uh, what's his wife look like? Yeah, that, that makes sense. Okay. There you go. Uh, no, I would not want to have a beer with him. No, he absolutely should not run for office. Him and Bernie Sanders can avoid real work altogether. I, again, I, I do not talk to inferior people. And this guy, I know the squealers. And then... And then Tony will turn off the TV. All right, that's it. Um, I'm sorry, Wisconsin. Hey, I'm Wisconsin. You guys got a fucking loser. Two losers in a row for governor. Great for you guys. We'll see you guys later. Toodles.